Good morning. I am getting ready to walk out the door to shoot blog photos today. If you are not following me on Instagram or my blog, I will link them both down below. Um, I packed up my bags, which you can see here. I've got tons of outfits and accessories and everything for the shoot. So I'm just going to stop at Target. I ordered a pair of sun or a pair of, I'm grabbing my sunglasses. So I'm talking about them. I grabbed a pair of earrings that I ordered online to pick up in the store so that I can use them for the shoot today. So let's go. All right. I just got done shooting photos and my back seat is a disaster. Um, I always change in my back seat. I don't know if everyone assumes that or not, but yeah, I'll just change looks in the back seat and then we'll get out and shoot the next look. So I need to empty out my car, put all of these clothes away, and then I've got some work to do, and then I'm going to meet a friend for drinks. So yeah, I will check in with you guys in a little bit. All right, so I am now on my way to the post office. I have some orders from Poshmark that I'm going to be sending off. In case you guys don't know, I wear a lot of my clothes just one or two times because I shoot photos for my blog and so I end up putting a lot of my clothes and accessories on the Poshmark once I'm done wearing them. So I will link my Poshmark closet down below in case you want to shop my closet. I am always adding new stuff in there and I sell quite a bit of my clothes on there so I'm just going to drop this stuff off at the post office and then I'm going to head back home, do something with my hair. I don't think I'm going to wear this braid. This was the um, hairstyle for the last look that we shot for blog photos today but I think I'm probably going to take it out and do something else with my hair before I meet up with my friend in a little bit. Um, I am meeting her in like two hours and I think when the town that I'm going to to meet up with her is um, a town that I actually need to do a return in. I feel like I keep saying I need to do returns. It's because I buy so many clothes and so I'm constantly returning stuff that doesn't fit or that I don't like because I don't like shopping in store but then I end up having to go in the store to return stuff. It like doesn't really make sense but it makes me only have to go to the store once and I don't have to like actually try things on and like shop for them while I'm in the store. Anyway it makes sense in my brain. I'd rather do a return in a store than um, actually shop in a store. So yeah, I'm constantly returning stuff. Um, my obsession doesn't stop. I am using the honey color right now. I will link this stuff down below too. Fresh just makes the best lip balms that have ever existed, in my opinion at least. And the honey color is one of my favorites. So this one is always living in my bag. So let's go to the post office and drop these off and then I will check back in with you guys when I get ready to meet up with my friend. I have a real question for you guys. Who loves Jock Jams? It just came on my 90s on 9 channel and I it just put me in the best mood. I love 90s music but Jock Jams just, it reminds me of skate night when I was in middle school. Comment down below if you guys like Jock Jams and what it reminds you of. Guess what just came in the mail? I just got my Zip Fizz, so I'm going to open it up and show you guys what it looks like because I know a lot of you guys don't know what it is. I mentioned it in my last vlog, so if you haven't seen that, check it out, but hold on. I'm going to open it and then I'll show you. Okay, this is what the outside packaging get looks like. This is the pink lemonade. This is the one that I always get, and these are what the tubes look like, and it's literally just like a powder that you put into a glass of water. You stir in and it gets fizzy. It tastes delicious and it has caffeine. So I'm obsessed with these. I get them off of Amazon. I'll link them down below. You can also get them from Costco, but they have um, like a variety pack and I'm just not the biggest fan of that. I used to get them at Costco and um, they're about the same price if you have Prime because it's free shipping, but it just has like the flavors that I want. So I just always end up getting them off of Amazon. They also have them on uh, bodybuilding.com. So sometimes I'll get them there too, depending on the price. The prices will fluctuate. And so um, wherever's cheaper is where I get them. Of course, I waited until I only had 10 minutes left until I have to leave. So I am just going to take this braid out, see what my hair is doing. If it has some wave, it has kind of a little bit. Um, okay, here's the problem. I did a side braid, so this side doesn't match it. I'm just going to turn on my curling iron really quickly. This is the T3 curling wand with the one inch straight barrel. I'm just going to try to get this side to match a little bit, and then I think I'm just going to do it half up. So I think I'll just put the half up that I'm going to do 
put up first so that I don't have to worry about curling that part. Sorry, the lighting in here is terrible. Um, going out when it's already cold out is so annoying to me. Like trying to figure out what I'm going to wear because you have to wear a coat over your outfit is just like such a hassle. I really wish sometimes that I was from a warm climate because I love living by my family, but I could do without seeing snow ever again in my life. Just not about it. Okay, so I'm just going to put some powder on my face. Um, if I can get it out of my drawer. This is the Cody Air Spun Powder. I use it a lot and it's super inexpensive. I've had my makeup on for almost, actually probably more than 12 hours now. So I got ready pretty early this morning since we shot vlog photos. So I just wanna do a couple of touch-ups so that it doesn't look terrible by the time I meet up with my friend. I'm just gonna throw a little bit of blush on. This is the Laura Geller um, Blush and Brighten in Boysenberry. It's one of her baked blushes and I actually really love this color for fall. And then I'm just going to touch up my highlight, which of course I am still using the Burberry one. Oh my gosh, I can't get enough of it. It's just so good. That is all I'm going to do for my makeup. Let's crackle this hair really quick. So I'm just going to take random sections and twirl the curling iron around them just for a second. Because I don't want my hair to be like really curled, otherwise I'll have to curl all of it. I just want there to be some body and some kind of movement in it so it's not stick straight. And I'm not holding it, I'm literally putting it on and then taking it off of the curling iron because I don't want the waves to stay. Or I don't want them to be like super wavy. You know what I mean. All right, good enough for me. So at least it has a little bit of body and movement in it. I hate when my hair just has no texture because it is so straight, which I am I really actually like having straight hair, but I like it to have a little bit of texture. So I'm gonna turn this off, change really quick, and then I will show you what I'm wearing and then we'll go. All right, again, I'm sorry that the lighting in here sucks. I like can't block the chandelier in here but I am wearing one of my favorite sweaters and then my favorite jeans and these booties don't mind that mask it is from doing laundry I just need to put that away I know the floor is not the best place for it but yeah this is what I'm wearing out to meet up with my friend so I will see you guys there I ended up not filming for the rest of the night so this is the end of the vlog I hope that you guys enjoyed please subscribe if you haven't already and I will see you guys in my next video bye